Leonardo Spinazzola, Amadou Diavara, Brian Cristante. Bu isimler Roma'nın yeni transferleri. İtalyan devi yaz aylarında futbolun en ilgi çeken transfer duyurularını dev bir sosyal sorumluluk projesiyle birleştirdi. Roma, kayıp insanların fotoğraflarını bu transfer duyurularının yanına ekleyerek büyük bir farkındalık yaratmayı başardı. Bu konuyla ilgili bir Sports, Roma kulübünün en yetkili isimlerinden başkan vekili Mauro Baldissoni'ye ulaştı. What would you like to aim by using this project? Well, uh, we we had the opportunity to explain many times that uh, we perfectly know that AS Roma, like every football club, uh, represent a very strong and powerful uh, social platform. Uh, the the sense of football uh, represent uh, a, a very powerful platform. Uh, We use uh, football and, and the club also in the past to promote some other initiative, uh, like uh, uh, an initiative uh, to cope with the uh, migrant emergency at that time uh, when we launched Football Cares uh, to involve other football club uh, to donate uh, in, in favor of the assistance uh, to a, a very unprecedented uh, uh, movement of migrants around Europe. Uh, so we always uh, have been very conscious about uh, the power of, of, of football and a football club uh, uh, in itself. So uh, we took inspiration from uh, something that happened in 1993 in the world of music when uh, uh, a pop music group, uh, Soul, Soul Asylum, uh, in the context of launching a new song that was Runaway Train, uh, decided uh, to Uh, launch a, a similar initiative uh, uh, to support uh, uh, some uh, uh, international charities uh, uh, working on uh, uh, the uh, finding of missing child. Uh, and at that time, uh, uh, the television, uh, and at that time uh, we talk about uh, MTV for uh, music videos, was the platform that was considered helpful in this kind of uh, uh, support for uh, the, the, the research of missing child. And uh, uh, we can uh, easily uh, say that uh, today probably the social network, uh, the, the digital platform are uh, for their viral nature, uh, the, the, the, the, the new uh, tool, the new mean, and probably even more powerful than uh, the linear TV uh, to support this kind uh, of uh, initiative. At that time, uh, the idea of uh, the Soul Asylum uh, music group uh, they, was uh, taken by Uh, the, the milk cartons where uh, pictures of uh, missing, chi missing children were featured and uh, at that time uh, with, this, uh, with the boost of uh, the initiative of the music uh, video on MTV they were uh, uh, able uh, to find uh, I think 21 uh, children out of 36 uh, missing children that were featured in the, in the video. Uh, so we think that uh, it, it was uh, a good idea, a good initiative uh, to use our, our presence in uh, the, the social media to replicate uh, the, same, uh, the same effort. How can those missing people can be found for you? Well, we are uh, collaborating uh, with uh, international charities, uh, uh, Telefono Azzurro in Italy, the National uh, Center for uh, Missing and Exploited uh, Children in the United States, uh, Missing People in the United Kingdom, SOS Desaparecidos in Spain, and also Missing Child in Kenya. Uh, these, these charities are uh, uh, well experienced in this kind of, uh, uh, of effort in, uh, Uh, finding uh, missing children uh, and uh, uh, with them we establish uh, this relationship uh, and uh, they carefully pick uh, uh, the uh, children to be featured in, uh, in, uh, in our uh, uh, player announcement campaign uh, that we can uh, uh, of course uh, uh, differentiate uh, in terms of uh, uh, countries and, uh, and uh, uh, geographical Uh, different location in order to have uh, the, the, the, the, the, the right uh, uh, the right, chi the right children for the, for the right places uh, in order to see if uh, we can have the same kind of uh, 
uh, of results that uh, at that time the campaign on MTV uh, could, uh, could achieve. How can this project be developed? Well, it's good to say that we started with two of these charities. It was the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children in the United States and Telefono Zuru in Italy. And after, soon after the first announcement, first player announcement, so soon after the launching of this campaign, the other charities contacted us. Uh, so we are now collaborating, as I said, with uh, five different international charities in different parts of the world and other international entities are contacting us. So I think that uh, this can become uh, uh, very much uh, uh, international and uh, I would say global. And I think that this can be very useful uh, for, uh, for the purpose that uh, we, are, uh, we are trying to achieve. How did uh, you decide to establish this project? Uh, well, uh, I think that uh, uh, Roma is Roma uh, gained a, a strong reputation uh, for the activity that we were able to uh, to, uh, to do in uh, in the social media environment. Uh, I think that uh, we are uh, recognized and considered in the world uh, to be a, a leader and, uh, and actually an innovative uh, player uh, with the use of social media. In uh, 2017. Uh, we uh, we probably we, we help uh, uh, the kickstart of uh, a new wave of a player uh, uh, signing announcement uh, with uh, the uh, let's say a typical uh, very funny and weird uh, player signing announcement uh, and at that time uh, we can we all remember that uh, a sort of real competition among all the football clubs started in Europe. Uh, everybody was uh, trying, was looking for the weirdest uh, announcement uh, of the new players. Uh, so that uh, uh, actually in 2018 we decided to kill off uh, this, uh, uh, this uh, competition, uh, uh, doing exactly the opposite. So with a very uh, low fee uh, attitude, uh, basically uh, intentionally using uh, bad Photoshop uh, to uh, announce uh, the new players and that become viral uh, as well. So uh, we thought that it was the moment uh, to use this kind of uh, uh, following and also expectation on our uh, uh, new player signing uh, campaign <coughs> to, um, uh, to serve uh, a charity purpose, social purpose like this. And, uh, and, and so for this reason, as I said before, uh, being very conscious of the social power uh, of uh, a platform like the football club, uh, we decided to use uh, the, our uh, uh, digital presence uh, to uh, combine uh, the, the new players' uh, signing announcement uh, with uh, this uh, uh, charity uh, social initiative. Do you think that uh, people from uh, all over the world will uh, react to this problem after seeing your campaign? Well, uh, I would say that uh, the reaction so far has been really amazing. A big media organization like CNN, BBC, uh, Mail Online, uh, but I, I can mention many others, uh, have been uh, uh, very uh, promptly uh, covering uh, this initiative uh, and, uh, and have been very gracious in uh, considering this initiative as uh, very, uh, very good for, uh, for, for the purpose that we're trying to achieve. And uh, uh, also, uh, if we look at the reaction from fans, from football fans, and not only, not, not talking about uh, AS Roma fans only, but also uh, football fans in general, has been uh, really very positive uh, and very supportive. So I think that that can help uh, uh, reaching the, the, the, the purpose that we have with this initiative.